welcome back to my channel this is dimples on demand thank you guys for coming back for another ride along weekend video uh today is friday august the 28th and you already know what time it is it is the weekend it's time to make some money and i am doing doordash i am on my way to pick up from the same sushi restaurant that i picked up from last week it is 6 20. um the order seems pretty easy but you already know how last week was for me it was terrible so we're giving it another shot today because we need to make this work i need to continue to make money here so yeah i am on my way to the restaurant right now oh i want to let you guys know that i'm starting off at 109 on instacart and 48 on shipped um i don't think i'm gonna make that much money this weekend but if i make if i make 500 dollars i'm happy so yeah we'll see how i can do this week okay and exactly like last week i have to wait for this food to be ready they're saying 20 minutes but i think i'm just gonna contact doordash and let them know what's going on and i really don't want to stay for 20 minutes Now I am recalling why I really did not care for DoorDash. Like there are too many penalties or too many restrictions and penalties when it comes to cancellation of orders and the wait time is ridiculous. So I had to wait for that order for 20 minutes and then I contacted DoorDash, which the wait to even contact somebody is like forever. I ended up getting in contact with someone and they said, unfortunately, there's nothing that we can do as far as compensation for your wait time. So I'm like, okay, well, if we have the order unassigned, are we penalized? She was like, yes, it can affect your, your ratings or whatever, which is like really, so it's like damned if you do damned if you don't like you take the order and then you're at the mercy of two individuals which is the customer and the freaking restaurant so what i did do was i communicated exactly what was going on with the customer and he apologized that i had to wait and i told him you know i don't mind waiting but i just wanted to keep him in the loop and continue on to union boulevard and when he was very grateful for me keeping him in the loop so when i got to his home he gave me an extra five dollars so communication goes far anyway honey it is raining as you can see and the area to dash is grayed out so i can't even work anymore so you know where i'm headed straight home <laughs> i have no success with this damn with this app on a friday so yeah if the area mysteriously becomes active again prior to me getting home i will sign on but i doubt it so oh my god and i will see you guys tomorrow i'm back um so right away the map turned red again and i was able to pick up another dash um it's raining so hard uh they it's like deja vu okay um as i was driving home the map was red again and i did pick up another dash um they sent me an order to chipotle just like last week deja vu and because i learned my lesson i ended up declining that order they then sent me an order to shake shock which i also declined and then they sent me another chipotle as if they didn't see that i declined the first one 
and now they sent me a Red Lobster. So I am in front of Red Lobster. And the only reason why I'm taking this order is because I want to see what the wait time is really like. So I'll know. So right now another Red Lobster is coming in. Hold on. Oh crap. Okay. Uh, there goes Red Lobster. Oh, I cannot believe I walked into the restaurant, showed them the two names that I have, and the orders are ready. <laughs> I cannot believe this. This is out of this world. Anyway, I'm headed to go drop them off. My God, I've never experienced this before in my life. Headed to go drop this off right now, and I will be back. Morning, guys. It is the next day. And I am just finishing my shopping for an Instacart order. It was pretty smooth, two customers. The payout is $45. So that is what I'm doing right now. Yeah, pretty smooth transaction. And I'm headed to drop off right now. Um, Last night, I ended up completing, I think, four um, DoorDash orders, and I made $51 on the app, and then, of course, you guys know the $5 cash tip. So, um, yeah, it's a rainy day, or very gloomy, and I know there's a storm coming, so I don't know how long I'm gonna stay out, but I will definitely take you guys along and see how much you can make today. I was able to get another order for $29. Um, it was so quick. I shopped in 15 minutes and I am headed right now to drop it off. Oh my goodness, I'm a little tired, but we're gonna push through. We have plans. Me and Thomas are gonna make it through today. Hi guys, today is Sunday. I never updated you on the orders I did yesterday. I ended up, um, I think I did three orders yesterday and I made $95. So today is Sunday, August the 30th, and it's 2 o'clock, 2.15, nothing. I have not done not one order today because I was running errands. Anyway, enough talking. I just got an order, Instacart, to pick up from King's. So I'm headed there now. It's a pretty simple order. Um, it's multiples of the same thing that this person wants. So hopefully I can make $100 today. Um, Hopefully I can make $100 and yeah, I'll close out my week with about 400 cameras all over the place. So yeah, I'll close out my week with about $400 or so, which, hey, it's better than nothing. So yeah, let's mosey on to the supermarkets. Okay, I'm back. I have not been updating you because nothing has been going on. I did that first um, Instacart order today that paid 20, I don't even remember how much it paid. I put it up on the screen. And then I took a small order that was supposed to pay $15. It should have been the easiest order, but the store had nothing that the customer requested so that 15 so the 15 went down to nine dollars that's what i think instacart's downfall is because the tip amount is adjusted based on the items that you pick up but at the same time we still spend time looking for the item so why should we be um penalized for that you know but whatever um i was able to pick up another order and this payout is 40 dollars. where am i going is this right this payout is 40 dollars. 
so in the railroad crossing all right girl so yeah um i don't know it's just been i have not had the desire to really work like that i don't know why it's just one of those lazy lazy weekends and i think what it has to do with is you know when you work all the time continuously like every weekend trying to make money eventually your body's just like enough already like you need to relax um even though i went on vacation it's like i came right back to working so i just haven't had the the um you know that energy to just really get out and work anyway needless to say i'm still happy that i'm making something which is great because to me any extra income is a plus like you know um i believe that's gonna be it for me after this order and then i'll close out the video to let you guys know how much i actually made this weekend which really was not much so yeah after this i'll come back to you guys so this is what i made this week on doordash i completed four deliveries and made 51.50 for shipped, I only did two orders, and this week I'm at 48.20. And then for Instacart, I made 306.59, and I received a $5 cash tip. So there you have it. That is the end of this video. I want to thank you guys for coming back to join me for another week. And as you can see, this is what a lazy gig week looks like i really didn't work that much because i didn't want to <laughs> um but next month is right around the corner and i wanted to give myself a challenge for the month of september i want to bring in at least five thousand dollars of extra income so i'm gonna go for it anyway thank you guys for watching um don't forget to like comment and subscribe share with your friends and i will catch you guys on the next one Bye.